Welcome, everybody. I'm Lars Eric Robbins, and my company is Lars Arts, all around entertainment. That's my slogan. Anyway, I'm an illustrator, and I graduated from art school in 94, and we had a lot of figure modeling and, and stuff like that when I was in art school. And I still try to keep it up, and most of the time I do a lot of my figure. I try to go to, like, local studios where they have figure modeling, and they have, live, you know, live new, new poses and stuff like that. Um, we couldn't come in here so I just have a photograph here of, of somebody standing and we also I, I could also reference this I could pose that in the same way as she's standing right there try to lean this character over like that and and pose one of these mannequins like that so those are different ways that you can learn how to from the figure but how you can learn from it is the more you draw and sketch from the anatomy of somebody the better you're going to be able to memorize how it, how it looks so you want to look at a, you want to do a lot of gestures. It doesn't necessarily have to be all detailed. Gesture drawing is just creating the, how, how the look is and how, how the shapes move here. You know, and that's something that you have to just have a mindset. Just like, okay, this is there, and this is how this shape is, and then it, it goes in, and it goes out. You want to be able to know that it's stable, so you want to be able to make it believable that she's actually standing there on a firm ground with her feet on the ground. You know? So don't worry too much about the details. Don't worry about certain parts of the body that you might want to draw more of. And no, I'm not thinking about any private parts. <laughs> Just saying you want to create the gesture. You want to learn from how the different poses is so that you know next time, oh, okay, there, there's the eyes right there, and, and it's divided in half, and that's where that goes, and maybe her hair comes here. So that's how you can learn from figure modeling. So I encourage you to go to the local artist studios in the area and see if they have uh, live models there and just go sketch and have a great time. Go some other artists, you know, and draw from live, draw from the people in the streets and just learn from it. And hope you enjoy. Thank you so much.